brief was a sort of a spectacular viewing experience, a viewing experience beyond the ordinary, but with a particularly close attention to detail and to colour. And so um, the idea of a volcano erupting flowers and transforming the landscape sort of before our eyes um, was born, of course, out of the brief. First and foremost, we want to push 4K and Sony 4K Ultra HD TV, their new range of products. Educate people on what 4K is, because people don't really know what it is. And yeah, create a, a powerful communications campaign. So 4K is effectively four times full HD. So we all thought HD is amazing, but 4K is something else, it's a whole new level. The Sony F65 is true 4K. It shoots the highest resolution out of any camera that's on the market. It technically shoots 8K, so it's doing a, a big sample. And when you downsample, you get a little more sharpness, a little more quality out of an image. For a standard to be emerging like 4K that's going to be coming into our commercial world constantly and being true 4K, that's pretty new and that's something we've got to prepare for. From a creative point of view, it's amazing to be able to see all those details and it's like having life right in front of you. Every day so far we've had some really big action setups. You know, we have three and a half tons of pedals uh, that we're launching into the air. Everything had to come together, like SFX, VFX, the wind, the weather. Every shot is an effect shot. Well, we're using a five-man special effects crew from the UK, Machine Shop. They've shipped all their equipment with them from the UK, so we've had two and a half tonne to three tonne of of air moving equipment, of, uh, of fans, of compressors, and they also have a, a six man crew in addition to the five man crew. So, any given location, any given shot, has an 11 man SFX team. So, one of the big kind of effect shots I've got to do is the SFX team came up with this really great idea, which is to get a 35 by 35 meter cloth, drape it out in a quarry, and coat the entire surface of that with different coloured petals and waft it so that you get this kind of undulating, bubbling surface. And we've just done loads of takes of that at different speeds and we're then going to kind of tile that up and then track that into the moving helicopter shots that we've done. My overall ambition, I guess, was to try to do it for real as much as possible and also to go as big as possible. It's been a fun shoot, it's been a great shoot.